If what you think you're looking at right now is a high polish chrome Zippo, then this is the right video for you. Now, this is another video that has been inspired by both many messages that I have received here on YouTube and discussions such as Amazon.com, customer discussions, where people complain that they actually think that they've received the wrong lighter. Well, this right here should hopefully be a video that should help you understand a little bit better about what you can expect to get and a little bit more about the black ice Zippo finish. Now, like I said, I have received many questions on this, both in my videos and in my inbox, about what is black ice, how does it look like, you know, I ordered a black ice and they sent me a high polish chrome. I had a jump cut there for a ringing telephone, but anyway, basically what I was getting at is this video will help you guys to know what the black ice finish is. Believe it or not, this is actually a black ice finish Zippo. Now it looks incredibly like a high polished chrome Zippo and that's when you're not comparing it to a high polished chrome Zippo or you know maybe this is the first Zippo you've ever seen in your entire life so you really don't know what to compare it to. Okay. This actually is a high polished chrome Zippo. Now let's pick these up together and compare the two. Okay now it's pretty easy to see the difference and this is actually the second time I've reshot this video because the lighting didn't do the, the difference to justice. But in its defense, the difference is not that great. You can kind of see it a little bit better there on the sides. This happens to be the Unparalleled Tradition Zippo and the Zippo Generation Zippo, in case you're wondering. And this is what they look like. Notice there's not a tremendous amount of difference there especially in different lighting. Now, what the misconception many people get is when they order a Black Ice Zippo, and it is usually due to the stock image that is used for the Zippo, is that it's going to be a black Zippo with a little bit of chrome coloring in there. It's actually the opposite that is true. It is a high polish chrome Zippo with a little hint of gray in there. It's basically, if you order a black ice, picture in your mind that you're going to be getting a high polish chrome Zippo with a little bit of gray, not even black, a little bit of gray in there. I've actually got a couple of the opposite extremes of the pole here to show you guys. This is a matte black Zippo for a color comparison. And the reason I'm holding these all backwards is because the fronts all have a design on them. This happens to be the production Zippo clapperboard Zippo action good this is not about the designs on the front this is about the finishes so you can see how far removed the black ice Zippo is from a matte black Zippo if I turn that up get a little different lighting you can see you would think that I'm holding a matte black Zippo up to a high polished chrome Zippo but you would be wrong again these two there's the difference hard to see on the camera so keep that in mind it's not a black Zippo with a touch of chrome it is a uh, high polished chrome Zippo with a touch of gray and I do not mean a Grateful Dead song in this particular situation it's a little easier to see on the front because it's got that frosted finish but like I said even with this lighting it's hard to see the difference that's actually a pretty good shot of the difference right there like I said, touch of gray. Every silver lining has a touch of gray. Here's a gray matte Zippo. When I compare that to the black ice, you can almost see that it matches up with gray more than it matches up with black. Maybe they should call it gray ice. I'll flip this over so you don't see the design, which it was the Lionel Train Zippo. You can see actually pretty clearly here that if I had to pick a difference I would say it's leaning more towards the uh, the left there the gray than the black so maybe they should call it gray ice well, let's put the uh, high polished chrome here on the top and there that's a pretty good comparison of all the colors right there you have a very high polished chrome on the top gray on the left black on the right black ice in the middle so keep that in mind if you order a black ice Zippo don't go complaining either to your eBay sellers or Amazon or anything like that because they use an idi idiotic stock photo I might actually edit that stock photo in this video somewhere perhaps 
here. You can see now that that's the stock photo that's used. Don't go complaining because your Zippo doesn't look exactly like that stock photo. It's a common misconception and I wish that they would change it because of that stock photo that it's a lot darker in color than it actually is. It's not. Like I said, keep this in mind if you're going to order a black ice Zippo. It is chrome with a touch of gray. Chrome with a touch of gray. Happy birthday, Jerry Garcia. Your birthday was yesterday. That's the third Grateful Dead joke that I've inserted into this video, and that is the kind of high-quality comedy that we pay for here on my channel. But yes, it is chrome with a touch of gray, and not black with a touch of chrome. Keep that in mind, you black ice fanatics out there. If you're worried about buying your first zip when you don't know what black ice is, I hope this video has helped you figure that out just a little bit. All right, guys, take it easy. No, I'm not dead. I've just been slowing videos down here for a summer, but don't worry. I'll try to keep get back to them, but I'm not dead. And go out there, and if you want, buy your black ice zippos. And don't complain. Don't say I didn't tell you that they're not really that black. All right, thanks, guys. Take it easy.